Hey there guys and gals and welcome to Let's Play uh, Rule of Rose. <coughs> Sorry it's been a while. Uh, kinda been busy. A lot. So let's begin. Cause we speak English. We speak English good. I love this game. Love it so much. It's awesome. Sony Computer Entertainment Incorporation presents. Oh, it's really a shame that they didn't release this in the UK, but I got it from eBay. So it's just as good. Punchline Incorpor Incorporated, I think. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. <sighs> Start out of breath. I love this intro. It's a rose. It's a rose. Garden. Bush. Thing. I don't know. Aw, oh, Carmine protagonist is sleeping on a bench. Wake up, Jennifer. I love this game. It's artistically great. The story is really controversial, but the storytelling is great. I quite like it. Brown! The doggy is called Brown. And there's two children playing in the roses. And Brown is gone. And I'm not an audio description service. You'd be able to learn that yourself. And some big fat thing is covering the sun. Oh, I love this song. I love it. Hey, where I reach my shade, I love this song. When I call Look at all these little brats. So please, what are you doing, you ugly little bitch? You <laughs> <heavy. laughs> do you harm? It's Margaret. I will break Brown. My arm. Brown. I'm a victim. Of your charms. Okay, Ori Kondo. Or whatever the hell it is. No one knows what that line really is. So, I said invent. I don't even think that's a word. As you can see, this is going to be very controversial. Ooh, blood. Now it's the metal. It's the metal ketchup. Jesus Christ. Disturbed much? That's a big shoe for a girl. <laughs> Justice innocent as What the hell are they drawing? It's a pig! Why are they playing with hammers? What's in the coffin? Oh Jesus fucking Christ. I forgot how disturbing this is. <laughs> oh god. Thirty minutes in and we're already getting into weirdness. Brown! Wake the Jennifer. And it's the airship. The very weird airship. Yeah, who's that old man? Ew. Ew. Brown, sniff it. Sniff it and find something. I love how she has a revolver in that, but in the game we can't actually get a revolver until the last boss. Bloody cheaters. I love this music. Look at all the cargo. There's an orphanage on that airship. Ooh. Water dripping. Oh no. Okay, I was really torn between either this or Alice the Madness Returns. Mainly because I like the story in both. 
uh, and the gameplay is something really interesting in both, but the stories are basically similar. Uh, but I chose this one because it seems more artistic. Alice the Madness Returns is quite artistic in its own merits. Like, the backgrounds are really well created, but oh fuck. I don't know. <laughs> that always fucking got me whenever I just started playing this. Ugh, imps. What are you doing? Dirty little bitches. <laughs> oh, is that what was in the class? Why? What the hell? Oh, what the hell? What the hell? This is so strange. And this is where a lot of the controversy came from. <laughs> oh god. What have I done? What have I done? I've chosen a game that's quite good. Um, aww. Now it's starting to store me. What the fuck is up with a flying fish? Okay. My name okay, is this is the end of the intro. I will serve you, princess. I will serve you, princess. Just kiss me, please. Aww. The poor mixed up children. The poor, poor mixed up children. Okay. No doubt I'm probably gonna have to do an analysis video of this after I'm finished. Because there is a hell of a lot of symbols. But, then again, maybe it'll be fine if I just. I'll try and explain them whenever we come across them, but, you know, I might miss something. Rule of Rose. <laughs> oh god, that laugh. That laugh. Hooray, press the start button. And I think that this is cutting a bit off it for some reason. Frick's sake. Options. Ooh, I'm at least follower. You don't see many of those. Um, there's no option to change the position of the screen, so I'm really sorry. Really, I'm sorry. But, you know, it's one of those things that wasn't meant to be. Hooray. Once upon a time. Oh, gruff voice. Little girl. That's nice. Her friend, the princess of the, the red, red rose. rose. Okay. Was always at her side. Always at her side. Then one day, her mummy and daddy Aww. died suddenly. Aww. And the poor little girl Aww. was sent away to a strange house. God. They're really heavy English accents. <laughs> oh, those English accents. Christ almighty. Is that what people wore back then? I think this is supposed to take place in Jennifer, 1910s. Jennifer, play with me, Jennifer. Jennifer, Jennifer. Read the story. Please read the story. Read the story. Please read the story. What happens next? Um, shit happens. Where's permit head on that? But the plate, but the pages are blank. This? Oh great! I love how this has taken nine minutes to get started. <laughs> oh, but I would change it for the world. <laughs> Wait. Wait! Oh, I actually said that in sync. Although, with my editing skills, it probably won't come out in sync. Run, you little Where shit! Are you going? Before I carry you. Oh. oh no! I was only looking, I didn't mean to get off. Bye bye, boss. 
And the poor little girl was left all alone. Oh, it's 1930s. Okay. I don't know when this was taking place. The little princess. <laughs> the drawing is so creepy. Okay, so where am I? And what the fuck am I doing here? Uh, la 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 la. The little princess. Once upon a time, there was a li precious little girl. Her friend, the princess of the red rose, was always at her side. Then one day, her mommy and daddy died suddenly. The princess too disappeared, leaving the girl all alone. And the poor little girl was sent away to a strange house. So I just read basically what the freaking hell was read in the intro. Or the introductory cutscene. Or whatever you want to freaking call it. Suddenly the girl was all alone. Hello? Can I get out of here now? And so the story begins. A mysterious, unthinkable, filthy tale. However, the young girl, Jennifer, had no choice but to surrender to the unsettling predicament. Oh, what an unlucky girl. Hooray, we can run. Can we run faster? Where, where, where am I going? I suppose I might as well follow the little brat. To the forest. Strange hell. At least it's not a silent one. <laughs> no, I'm not going to be like that. La, 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 la. Just casually wandering through a forest. At night. Alone. You know. The way you do. Okay, my controller keeps on fucking up. I'm glad I'm going to get another one soon. Okay, move your arse, Jennifer! As the girl approached the sign, she heard a dog's bark. It sounded strangely familiar to her and beckoned her to come. That's not a bark. It's more of a whimper. Have they ever heard a dog? Oh. Little puppy, come here. I save you. I save you, puppy. 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 Do I remember how I opened doors? There's an old padlock on the door. However, it's not locked. Hello. Rickety shed. I love how the shed has soil in it. On the floor. Oh, shiny. Pick up the shinies. <coughs> This qualifies as a survival horror game, so pick up the shinies. Pick it up, Jenny. A slip of paper is tied to the dog's collar. Or dog collar, whichever you prefer. It's a slip of paper with boarding pass and a picture of a fish on it. Jennifer found boarding pass. The name Brown is on the dog collar. I found a dog collar. Oh, fuck. No, the doggy. The doggy. Where's the doggy? Strange Hill, East. I can't help but read all text in this voice. Come back here, you little shit. Get back here. What did you do to the doggy? Come back here. Come back here. <sighs> When are we going to get to the strange house I've been hearing so much about? Uh, I think I'm supposed to go this way. It's been a little while since I played this last. Which is a good thing. I like that when that happens. Uh, la, 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 la. It also turns out my asshole friends want me to uh, play Fahrenheit next. You know, Indigo Prophecy. Over... What was the other one? Silent Hill 3. So, I might actually play that. Fahrenheit. 
following the boy up the road, she came upon a huge old mansion. <clears throat> it better not be the Barrow's mansion. For some reason, this place seems familiar to the unlucky girl. Yeah, it still better not be the Barrow's mansion. Oh! Oh, demon children. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. What are you doing, you rat-faced girl? Is that a rat? Is it supposed to be a rat? I don't know. What are they hitting in that sack? Children with bag over their head are beating something with a stick. Shouldn't that be children with bags over their heads? The unlucky girl was frightened and backed away from the gate. Um... I'm guessing I go around here? Come on, Jenny. Let us go. Let us go and investigate. I'm imagining it's this way because the foliage is telling me it's that way. Fence road. Eh, it's not much of a fence, it's more of a brick wall. But, you know, fences, brick walls, <laughs> oh fuck. I hear you, you little shits. Get back here. Get back here, you little shits. I'm going to swear as much as possible, because I feel like I should, because it's a horror game. Oh, hello. No one allowed without a pass. About using items. Okay. Uh. I forget what the use button is. Help me. <laughs> Derp moment. Derp moment. Oh. Ah, we can get rid of that actually, because we don't need that, and we use this. Nothing happened. Well, fuck you two then. Let me in. No one allowed without a pass. No one allowed without a fucking pass. Here's my board and pass. Can I go in now? For God's sake, dab bun. <laughs> <laughs> you fat little shit. You need to go and diet. Dietitian. Oh, Jesus Christ, what's graffiti on the wall? Uh, Legend of Stray Dog. Stray Dog gives us sweets. Are you sure it's a dog? Doesn't sound like a dog. <laughs> Sounds more like a pedophile. <laughs> and you're going to learn how right I am about this. Oh god. This is a tragic tale. This is a tragic, tragic story in a game, but... It's... It... I... It, it's popular. Oh, the fucking bag moved by itself. Prop hunt! Okay, well, this... This game is, it's popular because it's so artistic and entrance this way. Oh my god, no way. Really? It's popular because of its artistic nature, the story, the, I believe it was the design as well. I don't remember when this was released and the box is like way over there on the other side of my room so I can't check. Fat lot of good it would have done because it's in Spanish. <laughs> because it was only in uh, mainland Europe that was released. Great, the door closed behind me. The pre rendered door or something or whatever, I don't know. I'm scared. Oh, come back here, you little shit. <laughs> the unlucky girl felt the chilling gaze of many eyes upon her. Yeah, fuck you. Yet, she was all alone. Okay, obviously she's not alone if she feels the gaze of so many people. Whoa, hello. Well, fuck you then. Okay, I go up here. I follow the little brat. I follow the boy that looks like Edward from Clock Tower. And he was a little fucking brat too. 
and I know what he looked like because I was playing it earlier. I have too much free time in my hands. Oh, hello. In this room? The filth room. That couldn't imply something, could it? Oh, hello. There's a dolly that looks just like me. There's a creepy doll tied to the pillar. <laughs> that one looks like it gave up the ghost. What's that? What's this? What? Let me see it. Jennifer found old photo. There's a faded group photo taken in the front of the mansion. Huh. So the kids in this mansion are little bees. There's a rubbish bin tied tightly with rope. Well, F you too. About saving bucket nights. No, I don't want to save yet. I've still got a few minutes left. I still got minutes left, bitch. Okay, I suppose I'll go back here. Come on, open the door. Christ. Okay, where's this little brat gone now? Hello. Sure, go over there. <laughs> Why are they laughing? It's not funny. It's not funny. Fuck's sake. Oh, hello. Train tracks. Get back here, you little shit. I'm gonna spank you. Fuck. <laughs> Fucking belt you with a belt. Because that's what they did in the 1930s, I think. I don't know, they were alright with, with corporal punishment, so, you know. It's okay to joke about this nowadays. Well, nowadays is in her day. <laughs> oh, how fucking hell. I thought you already ran up these stairs. Oh, open the door, you little fuck. Attic storage. I don't want to look around because I think most of those little bloody brats are. Oh, hello. Pick up the note, Jenny. Scalpel, dental forceps, gloves, scissors. There's blood all over them. Oh. Well, I ain't going to that dentist. Orphanage map. Kinda useless now, ain't it? Use for some reason or another. I don't know why I picked these up. I have no clue. Don't ask. Hello? Is there anyone in here? Uh, hello? Hello, just some English woman. Strange. Oh, fucking hell, I thought that was his eyes glowing there for a second at the top. Hello. You want candy? You want a candy? Oh, no, wait, that's right. This is uh, England. It's in the UK where I come from, so it's sweets. Confectionery. When the unlucky girl approached the boy, said he said, My, aren't you a slowpoke like always? Here, read me the rest of the story. You know the book I handed you. <laughs> yeah, I fucking suck at reading. I also suck at voice acting because it changed a lot. <laughs> I think it changed like the old frick. Wait. And the parallel girl, blah blah blah, strange house. At her new home, the aristocrat club lived by the rule of Rose. But the girl found herself very much alone. There, I read it to you, little brat. We will now begin the funeral. Okay. All those attending, please gather around at this time. Okay. Anything else? Bing bong bing. Cheese. Oh fucking hell. They're a cult, aren't they? Come on, Jennifer. The funeral is about to begin. Okay. 
you want it's a funeral for your dear friend. <laughs> you little fucker. Before she was re before she realized it, the boy was gone. And the girl was left in confusion. No, the doggy! The doggy! The doggy! The doggy! The doggy! The fucking doggy! They hurting the doggy! The sociopathic children are hurting the doggy! Nose! Nose! And that's really hurting my voice box doing that. Doggy! 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 doggy. Doggy! Huey! Sorry, wrong game. Brown! Doggy! 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 I sound like... I don't know what I sound like. Oh, fudge nuggets. When the girl went out to the yard, she found a shovel standing before a grave. Okay, great. Time to dig. And uh, the unlucky girl sensed that something very dear to her was buried here. As if possessed, she began to dig furiously. Oh, uh, great. I didn't really want this to be this long, but it's gonna have to be. <laughs> Ah, all those cutscenes, but I want to get on the airship as soon as possible, so that I don't have to wait too long. It's a funeral. It's a coffin. That is one big ass. What the fuck? Are legs supposed to bend that way? <laughs> what a small cop. Oh, my nose. Oh my god, it's the bag from earlier. Oh my god, it's the little snakes from earlier. Bird, lamb or goat, fish and the pig. Okay. Just look at you. You're, You're filthy. filthy. <laughs> you little bitch. You fish face. Fish face. How is there that much water in that little cup? It would have finished, like, as soon as she tipped it. Oh, hello. Thank you for joining us on our flight. Attention, all passengers. No. We will be taking off in a short while. Okay. Please take all large luggage to section 8 of the freight storage compartment. Right. Perfect. Just bloody perfect. Fuck off, you little sluts. Oh, fuck's sake. This is... The emotion. The emotion. Oh dear god, the emo- Ashes to ashes. Okay, I fucking get it. Hurry up. Hurry up so I can be on this bloody flight. Like, god. Dust to dust, dust just to ashes. Who the fuck gives a shit? No, I doubt I'm in strange hell anymore. Oh, hello. Yes. Yes. Save the game. Save the game, please, Jennifer. Okay, I'll just save there. And I'll also stop here. Because Jesus Christ is getting young. What? You bastards. Okay, so while I fix out my savings, um, I hope you enjoyed <laughs> part one of Let's Play Rule of Rose, and stay tuned for part two, because there definitely will be one. Okay, so peace out. Bye!